Okay, 2012, question 6E. So we're asked to calculate the heat of formation here for the hydrocarbon C8H18. So I'm asked for this, okay? And then I'm told that given its heat of combustion value, so heat of combustion is C8H18 plus a certain amount of O2, always gives carbon dioxide and water, and I'll come back to that in a minute, has been measured at minus 5502. And I'm told the heats of formation of carbon dioxide and of water, H2O, are minus 394 and minus 286 respectively. So, Firstly, here I'm going to look at what I'm actually looking to make, which is C8H18. So that means I have eight Cs plus nine H2. So at the end, this is what I'm asked for. So this is what I should be left with. Next here then, I'm just going to balance this equation here. Carbons first, C8. So I must have eight CO2s. I have H18. So I need to have um, 18 hydrogens. 9 by 2 gives me 18. And just if I look here then, I have 16 O in my CO2, of which I've 8. And I've 9 O2, uh, 9 in my H2O. So that means I've 25 by oxygens. I have 2 here. So this has to be 12 and a half. Okay, and that gives me 25 when I multiply it by 2. CO2 then is C plus O2. And H2O is H2 plus a half O2. So now this is what I end, want to end up with at the end. So I'm just going to compare here what I have. So I look at this C8H18, C8H18, and it's on the wrong side. So I need to reverse. Okay. Then I have um, 8C. Okay. This is the only place I can get the C. It's on my left-hand side in both equations. So I just have to multiply this by 8. And finally, then, if I look at this, it's the only place I can get my hydrogens. Again, both on the left-hand side, but I need 9 of them. So I reverse this equation. So that means 8CO2 plus 9H2O goes to C8H18 plus 12.5O2. This I multiply by 8, so that's 8C plus 8O2 uh, goes to 8CO2. And then I multiply this by 9. 9H2 plus 9 over 2O2 goes to 9H2O. I have reversed this, so it means it changes to plus 5502. My minus 394, I have to multiply that by 8, which gives me minus 3152. And finally then, my minus 286 by 9 means that is going to be minus 2574. And here I cancel what I have on my left-hand side with what I see on my right-hand side. 9H2Os. I have 8CO2s. And 9 uh, over 2, O2 is the same as 4 and a half O2. So 8 and 4 is 12, which gives 12 and a half. And that's going to cancel with my 12 and a half here. So what do I have? 8C plus 9 h 2 goes to C8H18. So that then is going to give me 5502 minus 3152 minus 2574 gives me an answer of minus 224 kilojoules per mole. And that is my answer. Again, hardest part here is this, working out your heat of combustion always burns an oxygen to produce carbon dioxide and water. Eight carbons need to have eight here. 18 hydrogens need to have 18 here. And then whatever oxygens I have here, I must have the same amount on my left-hand side.